Hello, my friends and enemies. It's me, Scythe, and welcome back to Heavy Rain. And, um, I think we're coming up on some kind of crime scene. Probably the Origami Killer, or whatever the name was. And we're playing a new character, I guess. Ah, shaky hands, just like me. It's been quite a while since I've played. He do too me busy with um, school because school is hell. Yeah, I forgot the whack at us walking that's in this game. Zone is sectioned off, sir. Please step back. Agent Nam and Jaden, FBI. You got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Being a Check. little jittery today. Pass. I'm looking for Lieutenant Blake. Is he around? I saw him arrive earlier. He's here somewhere. Thanks. This voice acting is really good. It seems to be like um, the other guy is like not at the big guy from the last episode, but like the other, like the original little guy that we played as. His like, that entire section seems to be riddled with bad voice acting. Not entirely sure why. It could be for, like, certain reasons or something. I don't know. But as far as I know, it's just, like, bad voice acting. Video memo recording. Agent 470. Oh, this is high time. Jayden, Tuesday, October 4th, 2011. The time is 8.14 a.m. Some orchid pollen. The concentration of pollen in the air is quickly decreasing because of the rain, but it gets higher in the direction of the body. Gotta find Lieutenant Carter Blake. I'm looking for Lieutenant Carter Blake. Thanks. Lieutenant Blake, I'm Agent Norman Jaden from the FBI. I went by your office this morning. They told me to be here. Your office this now, if morning. If you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, will you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. Well, are you coming, Jaden? So. 
What happened? Some guy taking his dog for a piss found like a Toby body McGuire. about six o'clock this morning. We don't know much more right now. Based on what we've seen, looks like the work of the origami killer. The origami killer. Has the body been identified? No, not yet. We should know more later today. Any news on the coroner? He's on his Any way news on the coroner, Lieutenant? We've been waiting for an hour, for fuck's sake. Has the time of death been established? Based on the rigor mortis, must be less than six hours ago. We should know more once the coroner has had a look. Hmm. Any witnesses? None yet. Given the neighborhood, I'd be surprised if anybody saw anything. Tony, I don't want to see a single shit stirring journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. <laughs> We know the cause of death. There are no marks on the body. Chances are he was drowned, like the others. Hmm. Do you have any leads? My men are going over to scene with a fine tooth comb. The killer left anything behind. We'll find it. Listen, I I'm a little busy here. Why don't we discuss all this a little later? Back at the office. Oh, no problem. Back at the I office. Understand. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest. Hey, Jaden, you come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now. Sure thing, buddy. Time to analyze. County. Sample of no interest. Comes from one of the policemen present on the wasteland. There's the Harry corpse. Common. The victim is lying on his back. No visible signs of violence. That glove from glasses combo is really cool. Superficial wound on the right thigh. <coughs> Blood analysis suggests <coughs> it could be post mortem. Ow. Probably a scratch that occurred when the body was. <coughs> Ow. The report indicates Sorry. an advanced Bad and long-lasting state of exhaustion. Hmm. There's a small the origami. origami figure in the right hand. Fingers were probably closed after the time of death. The victim is Jeremy Bowles, declared missing five days ago. See reference file. An orchid was placed on the victim's chest. His face is covered with mud, like the other victims. To be everything about the body. The body got scratched when it was moved. There may be more traces of blood around here. There's a railroad track near where the body was left. Same as all the other victims. Orchid pollen. Something the killer couldn't control. Can it be traced back to its source?
Dead cat. The FBI doesn't keep files on dead cats. Not yet. So I guess I just passed over all of this evidence. Footprints. Or shoe prints. Footprints continue just after the pollen trail. There's a good chance that they're the killers. Harry Common. Traces of blood on the railroad track. Analysis confirms it comes from the victim. This guy's voice acting doesn't seem too bad. I'm heading back to the office. You stay in. No, I've seen enough. I'm leaving too. Yeah. I think we got everything that we could. Next question How do I get out?
Back the way through the big monsoon. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Pop the reverse. And then not in reverse anymore. Then make him out of reverse. There we go. And then pop him forward. Wow, so eventful. Bat. A bat. That is... That's Wolverine! <laughs> I see Wolverine. A yes, fox. fox. That's a crab. A crab. I see the Grim Blood. Reaper, so I guess... Nope, that's not... Blood spreading through water. That's not what I meant to click. I was I meant to click death. Fuck. God damn it. Everything's so high tech here. Wow we I have the results of your MRI scans. Everything seems to be normal. There is no physical damage from the accident. However, I am worried about your psychological condition. I know it's not easy, but you've got to start over, Ethan. You're not responsible for what happened. It's my fault Jason is dead. He'd still be alive if I'd been looking out for him. It was an accident. Accidents happen every day. I mean, it is kind of his fault, I'm You be can't honest. blame yourself forever for your son's death. Well, he can. Well, How not forever, Sean? forever, but for the rest of his life, yeah. I think he resents the fact that I can't live up to his expectations. No, I wanted to do I'm happy and God capable damn it. of making his mother and him happy. And what about you, Ethan? What do you feel? I'm a sad little boy. Where's I square. no longer want to live. I have no reason oh, to continue. Well, that's more depressing Not than even I for your son, That's Sean. more depressed than I thought it was. I, I couldn't save Jason. But I guess it makes sense. Sean doesn't need a father like me. Is there something else you wanted to tell me, Ethan? Yeah, why were you holding an origami? I sometimes have these Black blackouts, guys. times when I don't know what I'm doing. I don't want to immediately go to I recover consciousness. I think that's a bit. Sometime later, that might be a little much, maybe. But I'm someplace oh, no. else, and I have no idea how I got there. Do you think this could be related to the accident? You suffered a massive concussion and were in a coma for six months. We really don't know what effect a shock like that can have on the brain. Mm. That's the end of this session. Uh, we'll continue this conversation next week. Yes, sir, Mr. Redhead. Redhead redemption. <laughs> you were lucky. Yeah, that was a dumb joke. It's very rare to survive such a traumatic accident. Yeah, poor Eve. I don't exactly feel lucky, Doctor. See ya, Chuckles. He knows something. Hmm. Just has that vibe around him, you know? He just has that vibe, dude. Uh, play. Aren't you gonna go play with the other kids? I don't feel like it.
hungry? Do you want to eat some hungry? How did things go at school today? The teacher yelled at me for being late again. She's gonna send me home the next time it happens. Your teacher's a bitch. I'm sorry about that, Sean. Next time, we'll really pull it together, okay? Is something the matter, Sean? No, I'm alright. That's bullshit. What am I going to do to cheer him up? We're just not communicating. Feels like we're drifting apart. I'm Sean looks sad. so miserable. I wish I could help him. Just not sure I can right now. Sean used to love going to the park, laughing and messing around. Man, he was so happy. But that was before. Before, before the incident. Poor Sean. He probably got into trouble at school because of me. Guess I'm getting up. With my glitchy movement. A boomerang? You know how to use it? No, not really. I can never make it come back. Make Can I give it a try? Back. Come on, boomerang. I'm going crab mode. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> I've got to be able to improve my catch. Oh, come on. Everyone loves watching other people get hit in the face. Yeah. Mm. Just seem to remember I was better than that. Your kid's making fun of you, man. Pull it together! I need a timer. I don't want to play that game anymore. What game? I was just throwing it. That's not a game, dingus! What world is throwing a boomerang a game? <laughs> I think your child's broken. I haven't been on a seesaw in a long time. What do you think? Yeah! Yay, child time! That sounded very wrong. I apologize. I'm ready to launch you into the air with my man strength. And my Come man on, bones. Dad, Mickey fly. Yeah. <laughs> Yay, I make the kid happy. I good dad. <laughs> Don't go too hard though. <laughs> Yay, smiley, and now sad again. God damn it. You were happy for a second, small one. He seems to be having fun. It's been a long time since I've seen that smile. I'll find something else to do with him. There's no more seesaw. Monkey bars? Hey, Depresso. Merry go round. Merry go round. I bet I can push you so fast you won't be able to stay on it. Great! Great! <laughs> Go on, Dad. 
Time to yeet ya into outer space, kiddo! See ya in hell, buddy! Faster! Come on! Faster! Faster! I go as fast as I can. It currently looks like I'm going at the speed of light, man. Hey, Chuckles. Whoa! I think my head is spinning. <laughs> no shit, Chuck. Astronauts, though. <laughs> oh. God, I don't like that smile. You wanna swing? You want to go play on the swing? I'll push you. Okay. Come on, small one. We want to do all the activities before we leave, alright? Crap. Oops. Come on. Throw him as far as you can. Oh. We're not pushing dead. I could have sworn I got that, but all right. Hey, when you get high enough, jump off the swing. It's super fun. Used to do it all the time. <laughs> that was cool. Alright, just like one, two more things. Alright? No, we're not leaving yet. We still have activities to do. There's so much room for activities. Maybe. Or maybe not. Possibly? Mayhaps? Ticket man? No. I really want to put the kid on the, the character dudes that we heal. Excuse me. What are you? I like Candy. a packet of strawberry flavored chewies, please. Better not be any razor Thanks. blades in there or I'm suing. Um, child? There you are, buddy! I got a little snacker for you. Hey, I got you some chewies. I hate strawberry. Oh. Thanks. It was nice of you anyway. Sorry. I mess up. Wanna go on the slide? I l everyone loves slides. No? Okay. Is there anything else I can toss this kid around with? No, that's just another seesaw. Hmm. Is there a different flavor I can get with the child? 
No. Doesn't look like there's anything else to do, so I guess just leave. Looks like rain's coming. I think. Of course it is. Go. Okay. It. Of course it is. We're having you a know, big month soon. Sometimes I remember before. I mean, when Jason was still here. Sometimes I wish everything could just be the nice way beard. it was before. Me too, Sean. Me too. Let's take the tiny tot home. Come on, Lillian. Oh, cares for you. Hey, Dad, can I have a ride on the carousel? Can I? Yes, of course. Sure. Go pick a horse and get on. I'll get a ticket. One, please. That's a dollar. There's your dollar bill. Come on, Timmy. happening What happened to Sean? Sean! 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 Kid. Sean! 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 Sean, where are you? Martha! in the game. Oh, maybe the body we found was Sean's. We think that the body we found was the other guy was Sean's. No! <laughs> Time for more therapy. New bonus. Yeah. I think I'm going to call it an episode. So, um, I guess we'll continue on with this guy's story some other time. And, um, yeah, I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.